Hello YouTube, my name is Don from the YouTube channel The Bitter Car Guy and today I am attending a car show in the North Georgia mountain town of Helen, Georgia. This is Helen, Georgia, a town in the North Georgia mountains. It has a very German feel to it. A lot of the buildings have German architecture and there's quite a few activities to do both indoors and outdoors. There's a lot of shopping, there are restaurants, there are, is a very nice main thoroughfare for walking and of course there are outdoor activities like hiking, tubing, But today I am attending the 8th anniversary of Helen Import Day. So today I'm just going to walk around, look at cars, talk to some of the owners and see where this goes. If you're new to the channel, welcome. If you've been to the channel before, welcome back. I appreciate your support. Let's go look at some cars. Hi folks, so we are at the entrance to Helen Import Day and as you can see all of the enthusiast cars are lined up trying to get into the event. All right, YouTube, so we are inside Helen Import Day 2022. Got this Acura Integra, you can hear him scraping a bit. This is the Ford SVT Lightning, it's pretty cool. It's a Nissan 300Z. I like this Halloquin colored VW Bug. It's unique. All right guys, so I have a hat on because the sun is directly over my head, but we're in the show and we are going to start walking around to check all the cars out. There is a judged show car component as well as participant parking. So right now I'm in the participant parking we're just gonna look around real quickly and then we'll try to make our way to the show cars and see what we have on display. All right, so we got a 1971 Nissan 240Z and he has like a strut brace going on in the back. We got some racing buckets, manual transmission, a lot of carbon fiber on the inside. And then across the bumper, you can see like there's a carbon fiber bumper effect. And then under the hood, everything is nice and shiny. <laughs> so those were some of the cars we saw on the way in. That blue WRX STI, the Halloquin colored. VW Bug, the SVT, Ford Lightning, and then this is a VW Rabbit. Let's go check this out. I like his wheels. Gotta find out what kind of wheels those are. What kind of wheels do you have on it? Uh, what kind of wheels do you have? What kind of wheels are these? 17, okay. 17 okay, so staggered. Okay. Wow, at the size of the exhaust on this Miata, you can literally put your fist right into the exhaust. But like the black and red effect on it, this is the NA Miata. Love them. The location for Helen Import Day is within walking distance or relatively short driving distance to the city of Helen. So throughout the 
events you'll see cars coming and going to Helen and back or to drive in the surrounding areas around Helen. BQ, white body. Very creative. Subies. I just love the way these things sound. Okay, so this is a Vanderhall. This is a Vanderhall? Is that what it's called? Yeah. Okay. It's a three wheel vehicle. I don't think you need a helmet for it. In some states, you do need a helmet. In Georgia, you do not. Pretty cool. Two pedals. So it is automatic. This is the Fiat version of the Miata. So the Fiat, so, so to speak. I do like them though, because this one is the Abath. It's a little faster, but a little heavier than the Miata. But um, yeah, still got that Italian look to it. Very cool. What year is this? 2017. Yeah, that's yeah. So this is the Fiat. What model is this? 124 Spider. 124 Spider. How is it? Oh, it's fantastic. Fantastic. Yeah. You've had it since new. Yes. Okay. One person only on it. Okay. Yeah. Any mods to it? Or oh, not? a lot of mods. A yeah. lot of mods. Point them out to uh, me. So well, I can see your tires. Yeah. So uh, those look. What are these? Uh, the tires are Nitos. Nitos. And the wheels are chronic. Okay. Uh, I've actually placed. They come stock with two. Fives, I believe. So you went a little wider on the oh, tire? a lot wider. A so lot I'm wider. 235 now. Yeah. Better handling and grip? Yeah, oh yeah. yeah. Um, exhaust, muffler delete. Okay. And a bunch of uh, mods under the hood. Okay. So that means it's pretty loud? Oh, it's loud. Now, now these sound pretty good, similar to the Fiat 500 above. Yeah, correct. Right, but now that you've done the resonator delete, how yeah. does it sound? Uh, well, the, the Abarth model specifically doesn't come with the resonator. Oh, okay. Uh, so it just comes with a muffler. So okay. I just, I just did the muffler delete. Oh, you did a muffler delete. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And uh, it sounds fantastic. Okay. Let yeah. me hear it start up, man. Oh, you want to hear it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and bangs now is that a tune or is that just after you remove the uh the muffler it just pops and bangs on its own it does have a tune but it does pop and bang uh without a, without a tune sounds pretty cool thank you man. somebody's trying to copy yeah, you yeah i think so not as it doesn't sound as good though <laughs> <laughs> take care man no problem thank take you. care interesting looking little toyota truck over here it's got his like a scooter on the back in the truck bed. I saw this Nissan Gloria over here from the corner of my eyes. It's like a purple paint. Foam wheels. Of course, guys, my heart skipped a beat. Maserati Gran Turismo MC. How are you doing, buddy? Good, good. I saw the car and I'm like, okay, I know this yeah. car. How's it going? Good, man. Okay, so what's How going on? Are you the no, owner no, of Tinto? He's my friend. I just, okay, okay. Yeah, okay. yeah, because I know he opened up a couple yeah, weeks yeah. ago and then the grand opening is coming up soon. Yeah, next weekend. All right, so tell me about the car, man. Uh, 2013 Grand Turismo Sport. It's on a yellow, yellow speed racing coilover. It's dropped yeah. about three inches. Um, carbon kit around it. 
full yeah. Yeah, so I was on, I thought it was an MC, but no, it's a no, sport. No, no. Yeah, sport. Okay, but it still has the 4.7 V8. 4.7, same, everything's same. Okay. Yeah, the MC is just a different body kit. And is so. it original exhaust setup or? No, no, it's, I got a Lorini exhaust. Okay, you got the Lorini yeah. X-Pipe? Yeah. Okay, cool, cool, yeah. cool. And then I see the carbon fiber, I forgot what they call these. South Amber. Okay, the sound chambers. Did, did that make a difference? It does a little bit, like, um, it'll pop a little bit more, yeah. but it's... Um, but the Luini's, the, the X5 made the most difference. Yeah, 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 that's cool, cool. definitely the best. Awesome. All right, guys, so behind me, I got an Acura NSX, Toyota Super A90, uh, R35 Nissan GTR, CDWRX. And I'm just walking around, just looking. We got some JDMs over here, ATL JDM. So a lot of JDM cars were out. Uh, a lot of A90, A80 Supers, a lot of Nissan Glorias. And there were also some anime cars, cars that had anime graphics on them. Uh, pretty cool to see those. But yeah, the JDM scene was well represented throughout the show. So this yellow Honda Prelude is someone's crazy science project. Uh, when you go to the back, it's as if they took the back half of another prelude, cut it off, and then attached it to this car trailer style. Good luck to whoever sits back there. <laughs> okay, so right now I am at the show sponsor booths for Stick and Wrap and Helen Import Day, as well as Relentless Luck and other vendors. And you can see a lot of the show cars parked in that vicinity. But right now I am walking back toward the exit to look at the cars getting ready to leave the show. It's almost 3, 4 p.m. in the afternoon. The show ends around 5 p.m. So now you can see all of the cars lined up leaving the event. And yeah, let's just see what kind of shenanigans, you know, whether there's any revving or anything, or even just looking at the cars as they leave. out dude <laughs> What is this? It's a Miata. The best. <laughs>
this is it for Helen Import Day 2022. This is the eighth year of this show. And as you can tell, a lot of cars, a lot of great people, a lot of great stories. Thanks for checking out the video. Please like, subscribe, share the video with your friends, and I'll see you on the next one. I do appreciate your support as always. Thanks. This is Don from the YouTube channel, The Better Car Guy. Peace. not too deep but it looks very rocky so I would definitely have some kind of water shoes on.